New this morning, the perfect Christmas tree may cost you a little extra this year. Now, Michaela Evans is joining us here in the studio, showing you what to expect at checkout. Good morning, Michaela. Good morning, Lauren and Darren. Booth's Christmas Tree Farm says you won't break the bank on real trees, but you might get a little bit of a sticker shock, all thanks to a national shortage. I'm told the cost for farmers went up both this year and last year, so you can expect to spend around $10 to $50 more when looking for a real Christmas tree. One shopper tells me the price tag's a little disappointing, but doesn't really matter. I mean, it's not really a bad price. You spend way more money than this a week on groceries at the grocery store. I mean, Christmas only once a year, so why not get a live tree? But paying more is not the only change you need to anticipate. Boost is also seeing shorter Fraser firs rather than the popular 8 to 10 feet. Those are the most popular tree with the classic smell. Despite this year's changes, you don't want to wait too long. Booths tells me it normally sells out by mid-December. Live in studio, Michaela Evans, WMBF News.